Hello everyone, it's the Grand Strategy Nerd bringing you another episode of the Catalusian Unit Union, our Victoria 3 playthrough here in Stellaris. I thank you everyone for watching. I do hope that you enjoy it. And don't forget to leave a comment below as well as share the video and give it a thumbs up if you like it. So we left off just kind of expanding right into some crystalline entities. Uh, towards the end of it, I realized um, as I was signing off, I realized that uh, we actually do have another frontier outpost. Don't want to get too many of those. They're, they're kind of they're cost prohibitive um, as well as with the influence. But I think we'll be all right. Uh, we need to find another habitable planet out here, though, somewhere. Because the only other habitable planet right now is in Eschel, which we already have uh, Aragons already there. All right, let's research that. Clear, clear that. Build a science lab? Yes. We got already have, well, there's a lot of science here. Old Explorer. Ooh. That's exciting. We'll have to see what that was. We'll upgrade that to physics. Is it this one? It was. It was Chiska. And we're going to build mining stations over there. We need to get his. We don't have a lot of credits here. We're slowly building it up. It's because we have a lot of stuff. Now that's already tapped out. Nope, that's not claimed by anyone yet. And do that five. So she, sh that scientist should be able to do that other one there. Um, Psy warriors. I say we let's research that. There we go. Okay, where are we at? 19. Our governor passed away. Okay, I don't... I, okay. Let's get two physics labs being built. I didn't know we needed a governor there. I didn't think we did. All right, so I don't want to build all of those. That's going to be a lot because that's a lot of energy being used up. So I don't want to build all of these mining stations. Let's build that engineering facility. Uh, archaeological project, plus one first league artifacts recovered and engineering. That's good. Built a hydroponics farm there. That's already an engineering facility. Okay. How are we doing on the All right, let's build. Clear that, build that. Still no deep sinkhole. What do we have here? Who's unemployed? All right, relax here. 
Relax. Uh, power plant. Don't really need it. Uh, that's going to put us over. Right? Well, I guess we do need a power plant then. We don't have that much energy here either. So here we got to make a decision. Uh, clearly, I'm going to go with power plant. Need more power. You know what? Here, I think we should build this energy grid to boost our output of energy. Well, it's not a lot. Well, I mean, it's 10, 15, 20. It's 20. Boost it a little bit. It'll be all right. All right, there we go. And get some of those materials there. Ah, Lucrezia has died. At least she was able to finish that uh, that thing. Ooh. Yeah, we're gonna go with him. And we had another one die. Our void craft specialist. No, that's not all right. Research speed. Recruit. Another Lucrezia. All right, we got that done. Let's look at field modulation. Oh, that's a good one. Marina's going to pass away here soon. Oh, I see. We have asteroids. When we get, hold on, let's let's pause it here. When we get five out of five, unlock an ascension perk too. All right, so I don't know. Okay, ascension perk. Let us get interstellar dominion. Our place among the stars is assured and irrefutable, and the borders of our nation equally so. True unit is achieved only when the ultimate goals of a nation and its people are one? Kinda. Galaxy is home to many holy places, some more obvious than others. As mortals, we will struggle to divine the true nature of the universe. Ooh, we consecrate worlds. That kinda makes sense. Um, clear blocker cost is minus 100%. Hmm. I think I want to go with the One Vision, or the Interstellar Dominion. I think they'd go with the One Vision first. Yep. Okay, this guy. No, I really want, I really need more energy producing systems here. So we're just going to chill out. Folingar is where we're going to head next to with Miguel de Cerazuela. Uh, no. No, 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 no. We are going to go. I'm not ready to send you out on your own yet. Soon. Soon. Kind of want to know what's around us first. I thought we were building stuff. We're done building everything? Oh, yeah, now we are. Okay, well, they're migrating. Thanks. We get that done, and now they're migrating. What's this? What was that? Who's this? Young blood. Ooh. Well, it looks like it's time to start mass producing Corvettes here. Well, let's actually upgrade our spaceports first. Let's 
so we can deal with this new threat. Well, we could fail on that one, but that's all right. Okay. Oh, okay, that's what we found. So non, no contact from those from those aliens. Okay, good. And we're going to put, yeah, and there we go. Right, so what we're trying to do, okay, that's all done. So let's, as far uh, oh, okay. Well, he's not that good. He's, I guess he's just not that good. Two there. Oh, we only have room for one there. Interesting. Hmm, synchronized defenses? I think so. All right, we got to bring all these guys together. Uh -oh, we're just chilling out over here. Sounds like a deal. Ooh, construction templates. Our biologists have collected a vast amount of data on. Okay, yeah, 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 okay. Construction templates. Let's do it. Sins of a sun. The planet seems to either have been bombarded with nuclear warheads quite recently or been exposed to a concentrated beam of cosmic rays, perhaps from nearby supernova. All right, well. Where are they? Is there a new pop growing? Yes, a new pop is growing. And merge those fleets. And we do have, or need a new admiral. All right, now we are running out of power once again. Seems to be a, a running theme here. And now let's see where it's are going to put us over. Why is it bleak over here? I think it looks quite lovely. All right, come on. Let's connect these two together. There we go. Merge them. All right. Oh, we got a new election. Yay. And we got to upgrade these buildings. Oh, we don't have enough. All right. Well, you got to learn sometime here, bud. Hopefully, he successfully completes this one. Miguel de Serra's... Wait. The... Uh... My scientist? I don't know. Yeah, explorer with the destroyer focus. What is that? 20% building cost. That's good. Excellent. Need new physics research here. Disruptors, cold fusion power. I'll do that. Yeah. I guess it 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 was him. Oh yeah, let's get one of these. Who's the youngest? Right there. Lorenzo. So that was my scientist who got elected to the High Inquisitor. Really fancy digs too. 
exalted priesthood, and of course the police state. Oh no, our great scientist has passed away. Good thing I have lots of influence here. Military theory. That's all right. We need someone. May not be the best, but we need someone to work on this stuff. All right, send them out here. And still no new nothing new in order to to build. Kind of just in a ho hum waiting pattern right now. Well, I guess we do have a plus five, but right, we're gonna lock these adorable creatures up here. And I'll upgrade that. Usual encounter. Form alien vessel in the Iblene system. The Epsilon Menace. No one's really reached out to us, though. Or do I have to... Oh, that's right. Alright, let's look at this Delta Menace. What? Who has a stack of 4,000 right now? Well, that's not fun. Crystalline entities. I'll issue a special project here. Why are there so many? Communications established. The Galactic Nomads. There we go. They have an advanced system of internal communication that we cannot discern and have translated our language while lying dormant in our system. Cold days and warm nights upon you, Catalusian High Inquisitor. We are Ban Tor Uther. We speak on behalf of all the Nemarian souls aboard the collected ships of the Pursuing Waters, our nomadic fleet. You have nothing to fear from us, as the fleet has no interest in or bound affairs. We ask only that you expect our autonomy. We shall praise the divine. So you're just going to hang out on Iblean? Ah, trade proposal. Greetings. Send through an actuality to build more than we need in order to get rid of the excess resources. I prefer the caravan to stay nimble and burdened, so we come to mind with the transaction of mine. Require energy credits and minerals for the next crossing. In exchange, you may have five of our newly built ship. Go on. Scavenge resources. We would prefer to see whatever excess we generate is put to use. Yeah. Can we lower that? Oh, I'm sorry, we can't afford them. Heat and drought, that is unfortunate. Well, I think so too, but your prices are too high. So, a nomadic encounter that does nothing. And there they go. A missed opportunity. Oh, no, no. Alrighty, guys. Well, we'll end it there. Thank you for watching this episode. I love that you are following along with me here. Um, don't forget to click on that thumbs up. Leave a comment below. And if this is your first time here, thank you for watching. Please click on that red subscribe button. Let's me know that I'm doing a great job. You want to see more Grand Strategy games from me the Grand Strategy Nerd. Till next time, everyone, good night and good luck.